So I'm just doing a fire off on a package unit. Um, I have this air product and controls model SL-2000-N duct smoke detector I just installed. Basically right here you can see I brought my power into 9 and 10. I made 9 9 my common and 10 is power. So as you can see right here my switching legs are 7, 18, and 8. So my constant power is number 18. So I just took the power over from my number 10 and followed it down to number 18. So that is basically giving power to my normally closed contact. So I want basically everything working correctly when I have power. So number seven has power. As soon as it trips, my normally closed will then open. And then over here on this train unit, they have this emergency stop right here. So I just went through this circuit. So if it actually trips, it'll when it opens, it will open up that circuit and it basically shuts down everything, fan, heat, cooling, whatever it's in, it shuts down the whole system uh, for safety. Back over here, it comes with this magnet. You can do a magnet test if you don't have like a can of smoke or whatever. So once you get the door on, you can kind of tell if you got power correct or not by looking at this green LED light, um, basically stating it has power. It comes with this magnet right here, and right here on the cover you can see test magnet, and it shows you where you can test it. If you just kind of set it up here for a few seconds, it's supposed to trip. There it goes, it just tripped, and now you can see this red alarm light. Uh, obviously you know that your smoke detector has tripped, and when you have it tripped, it's a good test to see if you lose power to everything. I just did that a little bit ago and I had it in a call for heat and with this e-stop which is emergency stop um, this is what I have the power going through for that switching leg in the smoke detector uh, when it opens up it basically just kills power to everything it comes with this little jumper bar in there if you're not wiring a smoke detector I took this jumper bar out and then wired my wires across through um, I also have the common coming from up here that goes into the smoke detector as well. So I have a common and then basically my switching leg going through. Um, that is how I wired in the smoke detector. I've tested it. Everything looks perfect with it. The main reason for putting this smoke detector in this package unit is for safety. It's also a code here, this, this particular unit is a 15 ton train package unit. Uh, it's required code to have it installed in this package unit.